The more I looked into this air conditioning system, the more interested I got. And this is the air intake system that uh, I have. And it has three different places in the house where it gets fresh air to uh, feed the system. And bedroom number two has a small intake in the ceiling where it gets fresh air from. And also a bedroom number one has a small intake where it gets fresh air to feed uh, the system right there uh, from the ceiling. And also uh, the uh, front room has a giant air intake duct right there. And it goes out to the front room and it gets a massive amount of air to feed uh, the system through that massive uh, giant air duct right there. The return goes through the air cleaner, cleans the air, and this gets, the air gets sucked across this thing and it goes into the, this cooling spot and it cools it and then it goes out into the air conditioning. The cold air goes out into all the, the vents. Okay, here we go. So that one right there is the ductwork for the front room, the closest one. And that one right there is a ductwork for the far uh, air conditioning. And here are the two air conditioning vents in the ceiling in the front room that dispense cold air. And that one right there is for the kitchen. And along with that one right there for the kitchen. And here are the two kitchen uh, air conditioning vents that dispense cold air from the ceiling. And here is the bathroom ductwork that feeds the bathroom the uh, cold air uh, from the ceiling vent uh, right here. And this is bedroom number one air duct that flows and feeds uh, air from the vent in the ceiling in bedroom number one. And uh, this is uh, bedroom number two uh, ductwork that feeds uh, the ceiling and the cold air in the vent uh, right there. We have two lines that are connected to the air handler uh, evaporator in the attic and the one is a 5 8 inch uh, suction tube line that goes that sucks stuff out of the air handler and goes down to the air compressor. And the other one's a quarter inch uh, line that feeds R22 liquid into the uh, evaporator to cool the air. And this is the carrier unit that was bought in 1974 and has been sitting there for about 48 years. Okay, they're all done installing the air conditioning, and this is the, the return system, or where the uh, air conditioner gets its air from the house. It all comes in this little box here, goes goes across here through this air filter. It's a four inch, four, uh, four inch uh, wide paper air filter, and it goes. The air comes across there to the filter, and then around into the new evaporator right there. Uh, coils in there and uh, all that thing does is cool the air really good and uh, there's all the new uh, and they put a drip pan under the air handler with a drain that goes uh, outside the house and down the side of the house and drains out onto the ground and they replace that one fourth inch copper tubing that comes up from the air compressor that feeds the air handler the liquid R410A, which cools the coils down in the air handler, which cools the air in the air handler, which blows out and cools my house. And they changed the old 5 8 inch copper tubing to a 3 quarter inch copper tubing suction line. And then they have wrapped it, and that goes down and takes a bunch of stuff with it. I don't know what it takes. It takes it down to the compressor condenser changes it into a liquid and sends it back up that quarter inch line back into the air handler and the evaporator coils and cools all the air down inside there and sends it all throughout my house and cools my house down and i'm not kidding you it's just a vicious circle it just keeps happening over and over and over again it never stops and so they finished the whole project and they did a real clean uh, install. Of course, there's the drain pipe, the 
plastic pipe and goes outside and drains out. And of course, they have to put the drip pan under there in case it ever leaks over time. That's code now. And the air handler does real well. And it, once it gets all cold, it just pushes all that cold air out through, uh, through uh, all those duct works and uh, cools the uh, entire house off. Uh, yeah, it works really good. I'm real pleased with the, the company that put it in. Okay, let's go back here and look at this York LX two-ton air conditioning condenser right here. There it is. And as you can see, uh, all that stuff comes out from the attic right there with the black tube being the suction tube, three quarter inch copper tubing. And the white PVC right here is the uh, drip pan drain. And uh, this is the quarter inch uh, feed line that goes, uh, feeds the liquid up to the uh, uh, air handler. And this is the electricity that uh, feeds the uh, air handler up there. And of course, uh, the electricity gets its feed and this comes from the breaker box in my house, goes up into this breaker box right here. And then it goes, of course, it goes up to the air handler up there. And then uh, this brown one goes to the AC air conditioning unit uh, itself. So 